Hello everyone, welcome back. It's me, Mary, and today I'm going to be doing a collab with Faux Cherry. Bismarck's in here with me, and he's being really annoying right now. Anyway, so we basically decided to give each other a description of our characters. So, like, I gave her one of my characters, and she gave me one of hers, and we're just doing a description of them. And so basically, I don't know what her character looks like besides the description. So, yeah, basically she said her character's a fairy. She has elf ears. She has a dark blue short align haircut, I think is what the thing's called. I looked it up, and I hope I drew it right, but I don't know. <laughs> uh, then she said the character has dark blue hair, dark blue eyes, dark blue dress, blue wings, and... Um, so it's like blue and black wings, so there's black on the inside, blue on the outside. So, yes. But, yeah, that's basically the description of the character. Busy! They have white and light gray freckles. Bismarck wants to play right now, and he has his whole head in my lap. He has such a big head. It's so big. He's giving me the evil eye because I just kissed his nose. He's like, how could you? <laughs> you were the chosen one, Anakin. I hate you, okay? <laughs> Why am I quoting Star Wars? <laughs> no, I am your father. <laughs> okay. Uh, for some reason, that just gave me a memory of... There was, like, a Star Wars website... And I don't know if it was the official, but they had a game on there where you could combine audio clips and kind of, like, make your own story kind of thing. And I remember me and my brother would do it. <laughs> it was so much fun, but I can't find it now. And so I'm so sad. <laughs> like, I want to do it. I want to do it so much. <laughs> It was so much fun. <laughs> but whoever made that was a genius, because that was so much fun to do. Anyway, um, let's see. There was also, like, a game on there about Ewoks and making your Ewok village. That was fun, too. We played a lot of interesting games growing up. Uh, so, yeah... Ooh, what do you guys think the new update for Minecraft is going to be this year? Because Minecraft Live is coming up. I don't know if I'm going to watch it or not because I don't know if I'll have time. Because I'm pretty sure it might happen in October. I don't know when it's going to happen. Either October or November. And I'll be really busy. So I might not have time to watch it. Which is kind of sad. Because I always like Minecraft Live. But, you know, I watched it last year, the whole entire thing. It was so much fun. It was so much fun. Um, so, yeah. But, and usually uh, live streams don't work at my house because of the internet, but that one did, so that's cool. But, yes. So... Oh, so you know my OC Rena. Let's go off topic, and then we'll get back to this character. So my OC Rena, she has, like, fox tail and ears. I probably won't show a picture, but basically in every picture I draw of her, it looks like there's a giant fox behind her getting ready to, like, um... <laughs> I don't know, like, drag her further into the woods. <laughs> That might sound creepy, but that's what it looks like. And I'm like, I can't unsee it. It just looks like there's a giant fox behind her. And it looks so creepy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but, you know, weird things with Mary. I need to make more pictures to go on my wall. So, yeah. Let's see. Uh... <laughs> I like reading the uh, pictures I have on my walls that I've drawn. So one of them says, Why is the couch on fire? Uh, I don't know. 
That's my favorite one. <laughs> and it's just like the, the couch is like burning on fire and they're not even running. They're kind of just like, no, I don't know. <laughs> they're just probably because they're used to that sort of thing happening. <laughs> I feel bad for them. <laughs> it's like, why is the couch on fire? I don't know. How do you not know? <laughs> so, yeah. But, uh, back to this character who I'm drawing right now. So, I did my dark blue, and then I'm going in with a purple pencil. I <laughs> try saying that ten times fast. Purple pencil, purple pencil, pur purple, purple pencil. <laughs> I... Purplicious purple pencil. Oh, my word. Purplicious purple pencil. Purplicious purple pencil. <laughs> Wait, why is that so fun? Why is that so fun? <laughs> Purplelicious purple pencil. Purple, 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 purple pencil. <laughs> Beautiful. Anyway, so, yes. When I was drawing this character the whole time, I was like, I feel like I've seen this character before. This character seems really familiar. I didn't look it up, though, to see, you know? Okay, sorry, Bismarck started barking at me, and I thought my brother was going to come in here, so I stopped for a second. Okay, so, uh, I did this in more of a sketchy style, so yeah. Uh, I just got reminded of something. So, in my stream I did on Saturday, faux cherry. Well, uh, <laughs> okay, so someone joined our stream, and I'm like... And they were like, oh, what you guys up to? And I'm like, oh, you know, just talking about hamsters. You know, you don't want to know. And she's like, oh, uh, what? And I'm like, Faux Cherry, don't you dare say anything. She does not need to be scarred for life. And Faux Cherry's like, wait, how did you know I was going to say something? <laughs> because, because you did it last time. And also, like, someone's going to say something. And it's probably going to be Faux Cherry. I'm like, Faux Cherry, don't say it. <laughs> because I would say it. <laughs> but I didn't say it because it's a scarring thing, okay? <laughs> Hamsters and guinea pigs are scarring. <laughs> yeah, at least when you look them up, uh, cooked. Now... <laughs> Yeah, it was scary. It was very scary. Uh, <laughs> thanks for Cherry. You're you're so nice. <laughs> and then she kept like, she, she kept like getting and like copying pasting things from Google, like um, descriptions, like kind of like, uh, the guinea pig is like um, a really oh I forgot the word. It's it's a, it's a it's a food people eat in different countries and I'm like why why do you do this so you learn everything new see my streams are very educational because we learn about guinea pigs and it all started because Fo Cherry was like do you think hamsters taste like ham and I'm like I don't know have you ever tasted one <laughs> and then and then it just got out of control from there. And so I'm like, oh my word. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, it was really strange. It was really strange. But, uh, yeah. Anyway. But, let's see. So if you want to come and be a part of our really weird streams, they happen every Saturday. Uh, Come check it out if you want to. So I had a lot of fun drawing this character. I think she turned out really cute. I'm really excited to see how Faux Cherry... Faux fo Cherry... I can't talk today. How Faux Cherry... <laughs> there you are. Uh, draws Alex. Because I, I don't know. I don't draw Alex very often when I do. Well, I don't. <laughs> When I do, I don't. I, I really don't. The last time I drew him well was a side profile of him. So, yeah. But, you know. 
I don't know what to talk about. What do I talk about here? Uh, let's see. I need to make more art for my wall. Uh, my art wall. There's like a big chunk of it that doesn't have anything on it. It's behind my door, so it really doesn't matter. But still, it needs more art. So, okay, I think now we're adding blush to her elbows, apparently. So, I hope her skin looks okay. I've never done gray skin before. <laughs> okay, so now we're adding more shading to the dress. I used a lot of purple for shading because, I don't know, I thought it looked cute. Purple is very cute. But, you know... Speaking of purple, I'm going to be doing a collab with uh, two people, actually. So I'm going to be doing a collab with uh, Unicorn Alley Adventures. We're going to be doing a one color challenge. And um, she gave me purple, so that's cool. And then I'm going to be doing a collab with uh, Mermaid Bride's Treasure, which is a three emoji challenge. So, yes. I don't know whether I'm going to do YouTube shorts or not. Uh, I might do YouTube shorts for those. I might do full out videos. I don't know. It depends on if I have time and all that sort of stuff. My stomach is growling. Am I hungry? Probably. Should I eat? No, I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. I always say this thing. Uh, it, it goes something like this. Um, was that mean to say? Yes. Do I care? No. So, <laughs> I, <laughs> I always say that. I don't know why, but, yeah. And it's really nothing, like, it's more like, uh, I don't know, like, something weird, like, Bismarck, you look weird today. Is that mean to say? Yes. Do I care? No. It's just something funny. I don't actually mean it. I just think it's <laughs> it's funny, you know? But anyway. Uh, let's see. Let's see. So, I do like how the wings turned out. I feel like they do look really, really pretty. So, yes. Um, yeah. I feel bad for my left arm slash hand. Uh, basically, I burnt my hand, my left one, and then I bruised it right under the burn because I hit it on a chair. Don't ask how I did that. A.K.A. Uh, <laughs> I'll tell you anyway. Uh, <laughs> I was spinning in a circle, and I whacked my hand on the chair. Yep, yep, because I am a brilliant person. Okay, uh... <laughs> don't be like Mary, kids. <laughs> and then my arm has, like, a bug bite on it. So my poor... My poor hand. I can't remember which hand it was, if it was my left or my right, but I burnt it on a lawnmower. And I have basically a C, a scar of a C on my arm. Or it looks like on my wrist. I can't find it. And I'm like, I wish I could, because it's, like, hilarious that I have a C on my arm. <laughs> uh, basically, I was trying to, I think, raise the lawnmower. It was, like, a push mower and stuff. And I got my arm too close to the motor, like, the engine. And it burnt my hand. <laughs> I'm like, and this is why you help your sister. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, <laughs> but, you know, that was back, like, I think in 2020. Uh, maybe 2021. So, yeah. So, at the time when I was coloring the wings... I was feeling really lazy. By that, I mean I didn't want to, like, take my time on it. And I was like, I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> so I just kind of, like, hurried up and did it. Uh, also, you can tell, like, the wings are, like, really off. 
in a way. So yeah. <laughs> Do I like how the picture turned out? Yes, I think it looks really cute. Uh, hopefully it looks like the character. Uh, I, yeah, I hope so. But, you know, you know, you know, you know. So, yeah, I like how this picture turned out. I think it looks really pretty. Uh, I love all the blue. I haven't drawn a picture that's just pretty much just blue in a long time. So I think it turned out really cute. Uh, I like the shading on the dress and the hair and the eyes and all that jazz. So I added a pink background because for some reason Mary's like, pink. That works. So, you know, I did pink. Because it's a complimentary color. I could have done orange, but I did pink. But here I am going with the black. Uh, just kind of filling that in. So, yes. Uh, I haven't done any digital art in a while. Probably need to do that. That'd be fun. I think my last digital art was of Toby. I traced a pose and then drew him over it. It was kind of just like a pose study. Basically, I traced it. I actually drew that pose already with just the reference, but I decided to trace it and see, like, what I could improve. So, yeah. But I like how that picture turned out. It's a really cute picture. I don't draw Toby as much as I used to. Uh, he used to be my only boy character, so I used to draw him, like, all the time. But now that I have more boy characters, the characters I draw all the time, I don't know. Who do I draw all the time? Like, <laughs> I'm drawing Noah a lot. I've been drawing Noah a lot more because he's one of my new OCs. Like, when I have a new OC that I make in a sketchbook, for that whole entire sketchbook, you will see them a lot. Uh, and then when I reach the other sketchbook, you won't see them as much. Uh, so, yeah. Like, my third sketchbook has a lot of my OCs in it. Like, I didn't do much fan art in that. But as I keep going, you'll see I get more and more fan art. So, like, in my seventh sketchbook, I have a lot of fan art for Miraculous. And in my... Oh, my word. What's it called? What's the number of it? Fifth sketchbook. I have a lot more fan art for Hermitcraft Season 8. Hermitcraft Season 8. That's my favorite season of Hermitcraft. Just because, one, I could probably binge the whole season in one day. Uh, and two, Scar's hat is beautiful. Okay, that's all I have to say. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh, here I am going with that pink background. <laughs> I went really fast here. I did speed this up. Uh, but I did actually go, like, pretty fast with it. But yes, I hope you enjoyed the video. Faux Cherry, I hope this looks a bit like your character. Uh, yeah. And, uh, you know. I had a lot of fun with this design. And I will see you guys in the next video. Please like, subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. And every time I stream. Comment down below what you think, and also go check out Fochery's channel and subscribe and all that sort of stuff because she deserves it. She's a really amazing artist, and uh, I think that's pretty much all I have to say. I did do another collab with her, so you can go check that out. It's where I made Noah, so he's a cute. Anyway, uh, I'll see you guys later, and bye. Hope you have a great day.